Welcome back, SCX24 range, cool hand. At the trash pile today, by myself. Keys, California, oh, there we go. Yeah. All right, crazy people do crazy things. So we'll be seeing some stuff here. Stay tuned. Like I said, crazy people do crazy stuff. Two kids need two cars. Not exactly what the boy wanted. He kind of wanted a uh, enduro. No, wait. I'm sorry. Pardon me. Element enduro, something like that, or in Sandero. It's okay. I'm sure it's quite decent. Uh, I, I don't. I just don't like the way it looks. Wow! Did you guys see that? I will tell you, I know you've seen that. I will tell you, <clears throat> this has a version two electronics on it. It's a blue top one. It's smoother. Do you see that? Watch, I'll shut my mouth. You guys watch this stuff right here. Shut my mouth. Pretty smooth. That's pretty smooth. I'm digging it. Like a little cowboy dude. It's pretty cool. Showed Mav this morning. He pretty like he likes it pretty much. He's a young he's a young boy. I mean, a young boy doesn't like RC cars. That's just silly. So. <clears throat> About this little rig, I can't help myself. Everybody knows that. It's not stock already. Uh, first run, really. I put it. I put it on the test track at home, and about, about two seconds going down the wire staircase, decided that's not going to do, and I immediately. Turned the bumper mounts, so I raised the front bumper, and then I adjusted the rear shocks, and then added weight. Plus, before I left the store, I bought 18 gram wheel weights and extended axles for it, and put those on right away. <clears throat> Also did the Okie trick on the tires, popped an extra couple eighth inch holes in the wheels on the inside, and then used a the soldered iron blue four holes each through the tires. Just help out. It's, it's the quick uh, cool hand mods. The Jeep got them, seemed like it works pretty good. I mean, this seems like it works pretty good. You can see, I told Rusty, that body's getting trimmed like almost immediately though. I can't have body inter interference. That just won't do. Sorry. If I was paying attention, I would have had that. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty neat little rig, man. Somebody passing by, look at the crazy guy. Well, it's quiet time. So, I was going to start off this little session with welcome back, boys and girls. But then I thought, well, that would be wrong because then that's, that's giving people labels. We don't do labels anymore. No, 
that's not, not this day and age. That's, that's not unheard of. <clears throat> so then what the heck would you call people then? Huh? How do you welcome people? If there's no labels. Ma'am, Mr., Mrs., Sir. Hmm? Can't say buddy. It's just, hey. Oh, oh, I got it. Hey, you. That's it. That sounds, that sounds polite enough, right? Hey, you. Oh, man. <clears throat> What's wrong with people? Seriously. Man, I hope you people comment. At least a couple of you. Especially you guys. I really do enjoy the comments. Especially about this. You guys gotta comment about this for sure. And this new controller. I don't know, let's just say it says Horizon or HRZ00014. Dig it. No, no dip switches for uh, throttle response. It's all built in. So watch, this is out. Isn't that crazy? Very smooth. Very smooth. I just guess you have to spend, uh, you know, top dollar for Axial 124 scale to get their good electronics, huh? Get a four channel transmitter, smoother electronics. Interesting. And the servo looks like it's just a regular stock servo, but it seems like it's a lot quieter. I don't get that. This way, guy. Oh, yeah, man. Stay focused. Stay focused. Then at the hobby shop, bought a 450 milliamp battery for Tiger. I think it was just running out of juice. Can't have that. Oh, I didn't show you guys. Let's go around a corner here. Some crazy old headlights on this thing. Not even a run in them. Ding dong. All right, easy guy. Oh man, you turkey. What a turkey. Let's get some bruises here. All right. <clears throat> Sorry, peeps. Check out these headlights. See, we got them on. And then flashy, flashy. Isn't that cool? I wanted to get the uh, tail light kit for the JLU. Didn't want to mess with the wires so much, right? But this one, it's already got wires strung from the front to the back and all the other chingasa ways. So I'm thinking, sure be nice to have the tail lights too. Aw, oh, dude, don't dump it. Not again. Mess up one of the fancy stickers you had to put on. Tell you that I don't like how springy them shocks are. They got like different, different spring tension on them. They look stalkers, but they won't let that body drop down at all. I might have to change them out for some spare stalkers I got at the house. I wanted to drive it just a little bit though. Did you know? Wait a minute, who am I talking to? I 
not a single person. Here, let's kill the mice. Let's do that way, yeah. Hey, man. Or guys, or gals, or chicks, or whoever is watching. Cool little rig, huh? I almost didn't put the stickers on it. I really didn't. I like how it is. It looks pretty, just blue. I started looking at it. And I just I couldn't help myself. The stickers really make it look scale. And I know I didn't get placement right, because good old Axial didn't give a uh, a card that went with the stickers for placement. And I started looking online and I'm like, eh. So I placed them. They're good enough. The little stickers will come right off if I really get tired of them. Honestly, they're just gonna probably get ripped up anyways. Oh, you dump it? Get up there, get up there. On this side, though. Dude. All right, enough for this one. This is a guy. Uh, what do you think of the wheels, people? I know I've been pumping out them shorts. That's what YouTube says I'm supposed to do. But it doesn't allow me to do comments because I want to get it out to the masses. So say the comments for these videos, which I prefer anyways. Love this. I love this little Jeep so much. You know, thanks for the comments, of course. But, man, it's so fun. And look, I had these tires already. If you go back to my previous much earlier videos, <clears throat> you'll see that the Tiger the uh, original deadbolt now whatever it is comp buggy thingy I don't even know what you call them that's why it's just tiger uh, it had these tires on those brass wheels which are still on tiger and uh, I, I'm not gonna say they're great but I think they're better than the stalkers they do run foams with star pattern and all that stuff cut into them And the wheels are a little flashy for me. I had some uh, like Endura wagon wheels. If you don't know what those are, come on, people. Come on. Uh, man, they were on order for like a week through Amazon. I just finally canceled on Saturday and just went down. I had to pay more for these fancy jobbers. But. It is what it is. Guess we're not gonna go up this way, huh? Nope. On the side hill or what? Let's get out of here. Oh, hey, guy, where are you going? Oh, it's noon. It's noon. Everybody here go ding ding. Uh. Ha, 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 ha.
Oh, that's okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll really help you. <laughs> I'll take it. You see, these electronics aren't not smooth. They're just not as smooth as the newer version. shit talk myself. Once again, no kids are allowed so I can have the comments. Everybody should be okay with the S-H-I-T word. It is just a word. Oh, easy guy. Where are you going? get some comments on this junk. I'm telling you. Buds with me today and everything to listen to music. You did a pretty good job of jibber jabbering without no music. No, no Daft Punk for Rusty Cat today. I know he loves that music. He recommended it for crawling, believe it or not. <laughs> that is all a lie. That is all a lie. why you need a name. Uh-oh. Nah, that was a drone. The sucker's been gone. I almost did that once. Hung up on bumper. Oh. <laughs> bumper. Bumper and front diff. Oh, that's awkward.
Well, Rusty says he'll be here tomorrow. So that'll be interesting what he wants to drive. He says he don't care. Everybody cares. Come on now. You know, I care. I love this Jeep. I don't, I don't know if that Bronco will ever be as good as this little Jeep right here. I mean, seriously. What do you say? We'll go with the Bronco right quick and we gotta go check this out. Let's try it again. Seems pretty easy. Oh, sorry. All right, everybody's seeing what we can do. Let's go get the Bronco. Be back. Welcome back. As promised, let's see what the little Bronco can do. Huh? My finger situated here. Alright, nice and easy. Say that's probably about the same other little bit of extra tire slippage, wouldn't you? Let's see about coming down. The easy guy. That's all me. Por favor, eh? Let's try again. Oh, look at that guy. All right, let's go again. Get a little more, a little more gas here. Throttle. Look at this little guy. It's right up. I like it. I like it. But I think I just like the controller better. The electronics. Man, if I got all crazy, I'd be switching all this junk out and put it in the Jeep. <laughs> That's messed up. That's messed up. Yeah, there you are. There's that Bronco right there, huh? There's that Bronco. I think definitely got to switch them shockers out. And that body just needs to get dropped down. I didn't even see that. Oh, you can see the wheel weights. Yeah, let's get some more scratches. I think that's it for me today, folks. See you next time. Remember, Rusty Cat, be here tomorrow.